All right, how's everybody doing today? In this video, I am going to talk a little bit about why suppliers are gonna to wanna to work with you now more than ever. My name is Jonathan Pru. I am a part of the AMZ Soldier community and you have found the AMZ Soldier channel, so congratulations for that. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. We will be continuing to put out current content on updating how to sell on Amazon dot com and dot ca so in this video right now i want to talk about why suppliers are going to want to work with you more than ever so we know that there's some restrictions on amazon right now but um there's a re very real thing happening with the covid and a lot of retail chains are down so what that means is there's going to be retail trains that are going to go out of business. There's going to be retail chains that are completely shut down their businesses for maybe a month, maybe two months, maybe three months. Um, you know, we don't really know a time frame at this point. That leaves some of these suppliers that maybe had a very large presence in the, uh, you know, the retail store space. Um, that leaves them with a lot of issues when it comes to continuing to make purchase orders or get purchase orders into their stores or into their supply chains, right? So um, this is a this is kind of where us as online sellers are going to be able to capitalize. So um, there's going to be suppliers that aren't working at all right now because they're not considered essential. Um, those suppliers are going to want to ramp up as fast as possible. So it's still worth you know um, communicating with them and keeping that that line of contact. But if they can't ship to you and they can't ship at all and they're shut down, I mean, that just is what it is. Then there's going to be suppliers that are, you know, full blown where they're considered essential items and they have everything and they can ship anything at all times. Those guys are obviously people you're going to want to continue to work with right now um, as much as possible. And then there's going to be a space where, you know, they did a percentage of their business, whether it was a large percentage or smaller percentage, um, there's going to be a percentage of them where they were doing a lot of online sell sales. So they were selling to a lot of online retailers like ourselves, and they're going to have a lot, large chunk of their business that was, was going to be like the brick and mortar retail stores, right? So with all these brick and mortar retail stores going down, um, that's going to leave these guys with a big space of no sales, right? And that's where we're going to come in. So <clears throat> um, right now, those suppliers are going to want to work with you more than ever. At this point, their revenue has gone down because all of these brick and mortar stores have closed their doors. And this is where you need to start working with your reps as much as possible. Those reps, when you talk to them as you're calling your suppliers, maybe that's in your conversation, maybe not your first conversation, but let's, let's say your second or third conversation, you're saying, hey guys, like, how are you being affected by, you know, this COVID-19? Were you guys selling to a lot of brick and mortar retail stores? And they might say, yeah, actually we had a lot, you know, where you have a lot of business that's held back now and blah, blah, blah. And maybe that's where you can figure out, um, where now you are, are more valuable than ever. So you need to use your leverage points and you need to say, okay, well, you know, I understand you guys aren't selling as much. So obviously you guys are motivated to make more deals and work with me because now I'm here with money and access to a platform that I can sell on my FBA store or whatever that platform, eBay, whatever other platforms I'm using. Um, and they might be very, very inclined to start working with you or work with you even more right now. So I would suggest, you know, if you already have suppliers that you're working with, find out which ones are kind of suffering from that, from the fact that their retail, um, the brick and mortar retail side has closed and see if you can find ways to manufacture more deals from them. They might be willing to wheel and deal more. Um, you know, if sales go down, they might be able to cut breaks, uh, pricing breaks to sell more volume. You know what I mean? Just because they need to keep continuing to churn their inventory no matter what. Um, some of these suppliers have commitments to, to where they get their sources from and they have to turn over a certain amount of inventory to continue to get new inventory and, you know, all that kind of stuff. So um, there's a place for you to be able to push and get some deals there. So if you're looking for new suppliers, again, there's going to be the ones that are closed. They're just not working. Continue to, to keep that line of contact, communicate, you know, touch base with them once a week, twice a week. The ones in the middle, you want to 
see where you can fit in and see how you can add value and see how you can manufacture more deals and work with these suppliers because they're going to be more, they're going to be ready more than ever now to work with you. Um, and then the suppliers that are already in the world of their, in the essentials and they're already running at full board, probably even more than ever. Um, obviously you want to see where you can fit with them and try to make some deals with that. So I hope that helped. Um, I'm going to go through a couple videos this week specifically on why, um, our situation is going to, you know, where we can put ourselves as leverage points to be able to maybe capitalize, um, on some opportunity. Um, so, Stay tuned to these other videos. I'm going to talk about maybe some net 30 potential um, and some why some of these retail stores that may be closed right now may want to work with you even more than ever as well. So stay tuned. Those will be in the next videos. Hit the subscribe button and I will see you again.